Lake Mead water levels used to be quite high, reaching 3,717 feet in 1983 according to the Bureau of Reclamation. The water level had dropped to 3,560 feet, representing a loss of 157 feet. This loss feet. was attributed to several factors, including reduced winter snow runoff, increased water diversion, and evaporation. Since 2000, the water level of Lake Mead has continued to decline at an alarming rate. This decline is largely due to water diversion from the Colorado River to support regional populations and industries. In 2005, the water level was at its lowest point in history dropping to 1,087 feet. There was a slight rebound in the following years, with the water level reaching 1,152 feet in the summer of 2008. But the decline has resumed since then and the lake level has fallen back down to 1,097 feet in the summer of 2019. This represents a total loss of over 1,600 feet since 1983. The current conditions are worrying not only for local residents but also for the many species of fish and animals that rely on the lake. Unfortunately, it's estimated that if the current rate of decline persists, the water level of Lake Mead could reach record low levels by 2022. Measures have been taken to try to slow the situation, including releasing water from Lake Powell and reducing water use in the region. However, it is difficult to predict if these measures will be effective in the long term. In the meantime, the situation should be monitored closely as any further dramatic decline in the water levels could have catastrophic consequences for the region. Lake Mead is important to the Colorado River Basin and the economies and ecosystems that depend on it. Only time will tell if the current efforts are successful in restoring the water level to more manageable levels. The water level of Lake Mead is a reminder of how fragile the environment is and how important it is to take care of the resources we have. With careful management of water use, it is hoped that the lake's water level can be stabilized and ultimately restored to its previous levels. Without swift action, the water levels of Lake Mead could be a sign of things to come in other regions as well, portending an uncertain future for the environment. In order to avert disaster, it is essential to take steps to manage water levels better and ensure they are sustained in the long run. It is important to recognize how dependent we are on the environment and the resources it provides, and act accordingly. The 2013 Drought Contingency Plan which outlines strategies for the sustainable use of Colorado River resources, is one way to ensure that the delicate balance of the natural environment Another is maintained. Another is to join efforts to conserve and recycle as much water as possible, in order to minimize waste and maximize its usage. Finally, it is important to be aware of how climate change is affecting water supply in many regions, such as Lake Mead in order to develop better solutions. All in all, if the water levels of Lake Mead are not reversed, it could have serious repercussions for the Colorado River Basin and beyond.